Imagine a car slamming into your house, not once, but twice in just the matter of a few years. It happened to one Madison family off of Park Street. The latest crash happened just last night. Arvelina Jones spoke to the homeowner and has more. The Ortiz Aguilera family was on their way to bed when they heard a loud sound. What they came out here to find was a car crashed into their front door. The family is not sure where the car came from. All they know is the Nissan SUV ended up on their front porch. Police say a 24-year-old woman was driving and reversed into the front of the home. Luckily, no one was hurt. She go in reverse, but she's so drunk, he don't know what's going on and push the gas and coming through. This is the second time a car has crashed into the home. Back in 2013, a teenager crashed into the side of the house while running from police. For the last three years, Francisco has placed two cars in front of the home to try to keep it from happening again. The family says they're still recovering financially from the last time this happened back in 2013. Now they're hoping the city will put measures in place to make this road safer. In Madison, I'm Felina Jones, WISC News 3. The woman who hit the house was ticketed for her second OWI and operating a car with a revoked license. No word on how much the damage will cost. And you may not be surprised to hear the family says they are thinking about moving. Yeah, no surprise there.